Wolfish here. So, last time we managed to get ourselves killed in this game. I figured we might as well try to get the quote unquote happy ending. So, uh, yeah. How about we give it a go one more time? Part 2, per se. Sadly, I found out a bit too late that you cannot save in this game. So, I need to do it all over again. It's time, need to get ready for work. Takes me back. Yeah, the controls. Start well. Okay, I need to reheat the bento. Warm it up, yeah. What else? Change underwear. Uh huh. Can, can I yum yum now? Flashlight? Yep. Got it. Got it. It bent so yes. Mmm, meal deal. Gotta take that all in. Okay. Time to go to work again. Just hope this time I'm gonna find those stairs. Oh yeah, the first time it's really bright, I forgot about it. Just shows you the way where to go. I'll try to memorize it this time. Alright, forgot that you can actually run in this game. Almost there, I guess. Which way was that? There we go. So from what I remember, basically the first day is gonna be nothing special. Just like a tutorial. Oh, who is this guy? I know what really happened here. I was called to warn you all by, by the name I cannot speak of. The Day of Judgment will come. Yeah! I remember! Bring me food, or you will receive eternal punishment. Right. I miss this music. Elevator music. Oh good, you made it. There was an old lady, blah blah blah, scary stuff. Okay dude, just get out of here. So the first thing was... To clock in. Yep. Replace some food. Okay. Check CCTV. Okay, the guy is leaving. Can I actually rush this before the customers come in? Someone's coming already. Wait. 
just need to check the shelves first. Which ones were empty. Okay, this guy. So handsome. Those graphics. 4K graphics. I like I really like his eyebrows. This shelf looks fine. Looks like some some of the things are expired here. Fine. Yeah, I, I like those noodles. Shelf looks fine. Some of the stuff expired here as well. Yep. Okay. I guess I can't. Okay, I can. Anything else? No. Okay, just gonna get rid of this trash first. Get rid of it. Need to serve the guy. Still got more. Okay. What do you want, sir? Oh. Just scan the stuff. Remember there was something else I needed to take out. What was it? Okay. Oh yeah, the drinks. Nope. Need to restock the shelves then. Or not really. Gotta check that list again. Check the cameras as well. Expired food. Okay. No one's coming. The door is already haunted. Okay, nothing's happening. I'm gonna go back and try again. Or can can I just go? No. Don't remember this part. Recommendations. What am I looking for exactly? Don't see any tags. Oh, of course. They love the package. Hey, dude. It's kind of late for delivery. Yeah, we recently started doing this. Looks like this package is directly sh shipped to the store. Oh, how convenient. In the middle of the night. Okay. Sure thing, dude. I 
Um, I don't think I have much of a choice, I just need to take it, right? Okay. Day 2, no food. No clothing. We actually got some. Flashlight. Oh, yep, no food, no clothing. Okay, time to go to work. All oh, right, the VHS tape. Watch closely, really closely. Crime scene again. Okay. I guess it's time to go. And we're back. I totally forgot about the homeless guy who was threatening threatening me and if I don't bring the food on this bath is gonna happen. Hey hey. So I heard the door was broken, it was opening on its own. Are you afraid that it's haunted? Ghosts aren't really after all, okay? If you say so. Right, so this time... Need to get rid of the rats. Okay. Clock in. Need to get the right rat poison. Here somewhere, yep. Okay. Hey, little guy. Bye, little guy. Another one. It's just a couple of them left. the other two. Okay, just one to go. There it is. Okay. What now? Yep. Fix the rat problem. Someone's coming. Oh no, it's the crazy old lady. I wonder how they made the faces. These are like taken from real people, right? Right? Like uh, they took a picture, turned it into a texture. She's like. Arr, arr, arr. Anyone else coming?
gonna take her a while. So nothing here. Yeah. Well, what else can I do? Can I see? Can I see? No, I can't. Oh, finally. Another guy. What do you want? This is the, the cigarette guy. In a, I'm in a hurry, could you please fetch me five cans of beer and a pack of cigar? Hurry up. Yes sir, yes sir. <sighs> Go get it yourself. Yeah, exactly. Okay, what's the silver one? One, two, three, four, five. Okay, I need to return to pick them up. Okay. Can't I just pick up, uh, pick up all of them? Yeah, I guess not. This part is so exciting. Just walking back and forth. Yes, I am. Can't run in the store. Finally, two to go. Can go after this. Can give him the cigarettes. Just one more. No. Don't tell me that's it. I remember there was one more. Maybe I need to give him the cigarettes first. Oh yeah. The sixth item is the cigarettes, probably. Here I go, man. Good, now scan! Scan. <laughs> He's gone. I think that's it. Rats are killed. Can I just go now? All right. How may I help you? Huh? Huh? Where's Kankun? You know where the King Kong is. I thought I heard his voice. This was my daughter's house. What did you do? How dare you? Crazy woman. And she's gone. What now? Doesn't mean 
I guess I'll, I'll be waiting for another package. Noise is already happening. Should I wait behind the car, maybe? CCTV time. Oh. What happens if I go there? Okay. Someone's coming. Can hear him walking from all the way. Hey, my dude. Good to see you again. Oh, you know the unstoppable trend of orange stuff online. Anyway, there seems to be a package. All oh, right. Did you give him? Um, where was it? Here we go. Something's gonna happen once he leaves. I guess. Check CCTV again. Nothing here. Should I look at the crime scene? Oh, never mind. Okay, this time, food is gone, clothing is gone. Take umbrella, yes, flashlight. Using it indoors straight away. Oh, how oh. oh, sweet of them. And I'm stuck with the umbrella. Take. Yes. Let's watch this.
Okay, now it's time to go back, I guess. More of the creepy area revealed already. Well, so much better with a flashlight on. Right, so all the TVs are turned on. Hey man, you okay? Oh shit. Gonna check that that shit. Can hear something, but I guess, guess I can't. Need to go back. Maybe there's another tape already. Someone's either the the door is possessed again, or someone's there. Oh yeah. Moment of truth. The final destination tape. Last time it got us killed. So, how about I try and send it back this time? Yep, send it to someone else. Yes, I'm sure. I was sickened by the whole situation. I sealed the VHS tape carefully and decided to send it off to, us, to the center. Unfortunately, the center's address was on the box. When I was done preparing to send it off, I felt my tense shoulders relax. Too much has happened in a short time span. My mind couldn't keep up, I knew I had to rest, but I couldn't fall asleep. Everything about the store terrified me, inevitably I had to sit down on the chair to clear up my head. What did I see? What everything? Uh, was everything I witnessed even real? Although I was scared, I knew I had to know the truth. I wanted to know what, uh, what, and why it happened. So I turned on, turned to the internet about the store. Found a few old articles and forums talking about the location of where the building was made. One comment on a strange forum stood out to me. It said there seemed to be, uh, to have been gruesome killings at the property. I searched for the same user's comments. In 2009, there was a case where a man who was the mainstay of the family committed a more suicide. I determined to investigate the incident further. September 14th, the man killed his child with a kitchen knife while his wife was off uh, to gro grocery shopping to a local supermarket. When the wife came back, it said that she was killed in an extreme way. He then hung himself on the same day. Uh, they say that the woman was pregnant at the time of her death. The woman was killed with several nails punctured onto uh, onto her along with her child in her stomach. Wow, that's messed up. I wanted to, uh, to throw up uh, from the obscene images, but I knew I had to continue. There was a guy that replied to the comment and said that he worked at the same place as him. According to him, the man was often harassed by his boss at work and he had complained to several colleagues. And on the day of the incident, it said that he had emotion, an emotionless face. Imagine that the family had gone through depression and hatred occupied my head. I was very, it was very painful with the tears in my eyes. I closed the internet gently and called manager to talk about everything I had experienced during the night shift and what I had discovered. However, the calls were never picked up. It was the same over and over again. Then I received a phone call from Mr. Jose, a franchise leader that I had never met and had a bad feeling about it. Then, with a shivering voice, he said the manager is dead, I couldn't breathe, so I was, it wasn't a dream. And when I asked about the place uh, where it was found, Mr. Hosoi, why, why I read Jose, I have no idea, said there was an old storage behind a convenience store that 
and he was found there at the day of his death. I dropped my phone. I quit my part-time job with a broken feeling. After quitting, I would avoid going near the convenience store whenever I could because every time I passed in front of the store, I would always feel the sharp stairs that someone was staring at me and I was afraid to look at the building. Day later, the store had closed down. The reason seems to be due to poor management, but further details were not publicized at this point. Means that um, I can't um, can't look into it anymore. After a while, the memories of the convenience store started to haze down a bit. One day, as I passed by the now closed down store, I heard a child's voice. There, I saw the woman. Which woman? Is it the one that killed us last time? When we saw the tape, like in the Cole movie. Or sorry, what was the name of it? The Ring? Oh, I guess that's it. So, literally there is... I did ex everything, everything was done exactly the same way. <laughs> Just had to send the send the tape back. So yeah, it's a it's a pretty fun game, but I, I expected a bit more um, out of the happy ending. It's like uh, basically the same thing. Just uh, got a whole bunch of tags, but yeah, it's it's fun. And I guess that's that. I really like uh, the the you know the vibe, the atmosphere of this game gonna try out a couple more games from this creature hope it good hope it's gonna be good